Now, today's quest is called Leave Only Footprints, and for this one, you need to clear four husk encampments in successful missions in a 9 plus zone, and you need to complete two missions in a 9 plus zone. Now, for this one, there are two different ways that you can go about completing this quest. If you are lucky enough to have a Destroy the Encampments mission available to you, then you can go in to the Destroy Encampments mission to complete this quest. Now, with the Destroy Encampments missions, you do need to complete five encampments in order to complete the mission, and then you will have three additional encampments which you can do for extra rewards on top. So you will easily be able to clear your four encampments within that mission itself. If you haven't done a Destroy Encampments mission before, then just so that you know, when you spawn into the map, each encampment as you go through them is going to be highlighted by this big sort of beam of light that will be coming out of it. So normally if you look up into the sky, you'll be able to locate where the encampments are and you'll be able to just go over and complete them. Now, if you are playing with other people, then of course it's going to be so much easier for you. You're going to have a few people working on these encampments. But in this mission type, the encampments do get stronger with every one that you do. So by the time you get to your fifth encampment, they are going to be a lot more powerful than the first one when you go in. So do bear that in mind. If you are a little low on your power level or you're struggling or you're not sure, then you can also complete this quest in any other mission type as well. Now, for this video, I did go in to a fight the storm mission and whenever you go into any other missions you are going to have several encampments around the map as well now the difference in this case if it's not a destroy the encampments mission you won't get that beam of light to show you where the encampments are you are going to need to go around the map and look for them they will be completely random where they spawn they will also be completely random what husks will come out of them but generally they can be a lot easier to complete because unlike the Destroy Encampments mission, they don't get more and more powerful every one you do. They'll all be pretty standard to the power level of the mission that you're in. So it is entirely up to you which of the two ways you would like to complete it, but you can complete it in any mission type that you go into. Now, as for heroes and loadouts to use for this mission, again, it is going to be personal preference which you prefer. I do prefer to use a teddy loadout with a turret gadget as well because when you are going around your encampments you're going to have a teddy dealing damage you're going to have turrets dealing damage if you've got other players with you they will be helping to deal damage and you will be able to complete it in my opinion a lot easier but it's personal preference you can use ninjas soldiers whichever i don't really recommend constructors they're not going to be that great for this sort of mission but any other hero type is going to work pretty well for you so that is your leave only footprints mission the only thing you do need to make sure once you have cleared all your encampments make sure you finish that mission with a victory you then need to do a second mission of any type it doesn't matter as long as it is a nine plus zone and that will complete your stonewood quest so i hope you do find this video useful if you do drop me a like down below any comments are much appreciated i try and respond to as many as i can hope you have a fantastic day stay safe commanders and i will see you on the next one